Hi my scaredy cats, my name is Kate from Scaredy Cat Gaming, and we are back in with Pocket Mirror. Now, last time we left off, we left off... ...in the ballroom, where everybody was dancing. It seems I got a key. I don't remember what for though. this door. Yeah. Ooh. These are pretty. Oh, this maid uniform looks a lot like the ones at home. Have you heard the rumors? They say Mrs. Fox has slipped into a, an eternal slumber due to what happened. Oh, I love stories with unhappy endings. What a horrible thing to say. I don't especially like black dresses. This isn't black. They always tell me to turn around when they're changing clothes. It's so unfair. Such a frilly dress, it's so elegant. This dress feels somewhat non-stolic. They're moving. Don't go there. I better not. Okay, now I'm gonna go save and then we're gonna go through the mirrors. are blue and red, also black, but let's go through blue. Oh. They're broken. Come closer, little girl. Come closer. I have a big what? secret to tell you. What is it, Mr. Pumpkin? I am actually... Yes. A pumpkin! <laughs> That's kind of cute. Don't pay attention to the guy over there. He thinks he's a comedian. <laughs> it's funny. Oh. What happens if I get in the guy's sight? What's going on here? Hey, you! might a young girl like yourself be doing here? Can't you see there's a very important investigation going on right now? Oh, I'm sorry. I was just... Oh, well, it doesn't really matter, to be honest. Tell me, do you happen to know how to read? Yes, I do. Great. Then could you please read this riddle for me? I killed not one, but eight in pairs of two. Clap your hands and you'll be able to see through. That, de that detective is pretty ignorant. He will never see the answer. Kisses and hugs from the ultimate best dancer. 
what was that? Who wrote that riddle? Did you read it wrong, you foul-mouthed girl? No, I read exactly what, what was written here. You know what? I have better things to do than play detective. Guards, execute them both. I want to go home. No, wait! Good job, guards. Our work here is done. As for you, little girl, you can have this. Acquired a bloody bag. Oh! Thanks, I guess. I was sleeping when it all happened. Too bad. Who do you think it was? I'm sure it was Mr. Rabbit and Mr. Fox. They wouldn't do something like this. It wasn't me, for sure. I really don't like the detective. Isn't he kind of dumb? Yeah. Maybe now I can audition to become the queen's next favorite person. Door won't budge. It won't budge. It's shut tight. I still can't see my own reflection. That was one job well done, am I right? Don't touch anything in order to disturb our investigation. Are you gonna say the same thing? Yeah, you are. Only the heads of two dancers were left in a bed of bloodied stuffing. All that's left is a pool of blood where they once may have rested one of the murdered couples. Torn parts of couples' bodies lay on the floor surrounded by crimson blood and stuffing. Laying on the ground, the couple rests in a pool of blood, their faces completely un unrecognizable. sea of stars lays behind the pillow, floating softly in a whimsical, never-ending flow. Oh, it's just the same thing. Okay, so what do I do with this bloody bag? Acquired two severed arms. Acquired a severed leg. Okay, I'm gonna go back now. Goodbye. Go back. a lot of trouble for us, miss. I can't thank you enough. Don't worry, Mr. Rabbit. I will definitely save you both. Thank you, miss. I guess we're gonna go through red now. This is kinda creepy. I don't like this. I mean I do, but it's still really creepy.
Are these gonna say something different now? That's what you get. Oh. That's what you get. Oh. Corpses lay in a pool of bloody stuffing. Although they're completely torn apart, their hands are still joined in a firm grip. Why are they holding hands? It's touch it shut tight. That was quite a show, miss. You should have been here to watch. was reduced to a pool of blood and stuffing. Acquired a severed leg. One of their hands came flying by me. It was so scary. So, their limbs went flying through the air like swoosh and bam. The door won't budge. Oh, I can go in here. I don't have many legs. Please spare me. I have a family. Oh no. There's something strange inside. Don't you dare give me into those guards. Is there anyone looking for me out there? I don't know. I desperately need your help. You're the only one who can help me. Alright, I need you to go outside and come back to tell me what's going on. Can you do that? I'll try. Queen's orders. Hey miss, what are you doing here? I was just a little girl like yourself shouldn't be wandering around in a place like this. I'm sorry, I just were looking for a fugitive dancer. Have you seen her by any chance? I see. Please do let us know if you see her. She's a very serious threat to the kingdom's safety. I see. are looking for you outside, miss. I see. Could you open this cabinet for me? All right. I got you. You're going outside with me now. What are you doing? Let me go. What's all this ruckus? That's her. We found the murderer. Please let me go. Silence. This girl is now my hostage. Shoot me and we shall die as well. Please wait a minute. I knew 
that wasn't gonna end well. So I have to rat her out. All right, let's, let's rat out a fox. Okay, I went to the red mirror this time. parts from so we're just going to acquire a separate leg this door won't budge Side, I'll try. Hey, miss, what are you doing here? I was just a little girl that like you shouldn't be wandering around in a place like this. I'm sorry. We're looking for a fugitive dancer. Have you seen her by any chance? Yes, I have. You have? Where is she? Inside the cabinet in the tea room. Guards, you hurt her, but please don't hurt her. Traitor, why did you give me in? I will never forgive you. Whenever here's done, man, let us go back to report to the queen. I'm sorry. The torn body of the dancer, blood pours out of the hole. I have no choice. I'm so sorry. with a lot of death. <laughs> okay. I believe I got only fox parts. Leaf body parts. through the purple mirror. Queen's here. Too bad I'm stuck facing the wall. This is a very special day. The Queen has just arrived, I think. Huh? What's going on here? I'm just here to watch them all be excited. That's an awful thing to say. I'm having a weird... Deja vu. What's a deja vu? It's when stupid people ask ignorant questions. <laughs> I like that. I've waited half of my whole life for this moment. I wonder who will win. This is so thrilling. 
Doors closed. Doors closed. Door won't budge. Thank you for all attending this very special ceremony. You have all given me your best, but as you know, only one of you can become my favorite couple. All the others who don't make it will be executed. Executed. Who dares interrupt my ceremony? I'm just silence. Who are you? Where did you come from? What are you doing at my ceremony? I'm just looking for something. Oh, and what might that be? I'm looking for... Something I lost. I see, that's unfortunate. Take a seat, my girl. I will let you look for it, for whatever it is that you've lost after the ceremony. Thank you. Can I move now? Oh, yeah, I can move. Even if we don't win, we shall pair together as lovers. Our love is eternal, both in life and death. Wow, this music is very loud. We won't ever forgive them if we lose. Our grudge will haunt them forever. We're feeling really nervous, miss. Please root for us. I will. This is way too cruel. We've given it all, all and yet we don't stand a chance against them. You two are. It's no use living if we don't win. We're grateful for this execution. I wish you could dance like them, but unfortunately, I'm just a pumpkin. Now, I shall announce the winning couple, which is... Mr. Rabbit and Mrs. Fox. Congratulations to the winners. You may step aside. As for all of you failures, you shall be executed. She can't just murder everyone. Soldiers, march! Wait, farewell my servants, you have served me well. Now that's taken care of, it's time for tea. As for you, clean up this mess before leaving, will you? Or else, yes I will. A severed arm. Pitch black stuffing slowly oozes from the dancer's wounds, staining their once clean fur. Required two severed legs. The couple's bodies lie torn apart, their expressions forever frozen in the moments of terror felt before their executions. This is horrible. Torso. Okay, well, they all went through this door. No, can't go through there. I'm just gonna leave then. So, uh, bye. I'm so sorry, Mr. Robert, but this is all I could find for now. That's quite alright, my girl. Thank you for helping. I'm glad I was able to help you. I better fix Mr. Robert first. I gathered enough parts for you, Mr. Fox. Hopefully we can fix these. You've gone through so much trouble for this. I, I can't thank you enough. I'm so glad I could help you. Tell me, do you know how to sew? <laughs> Yes, I do. Would you please sew us back together? I wish to be reunited with Miss Fox. Of course. Let me just find something to sew you with. A 
Oh, so you first, Mr. Robert. Please do. There, all done. Can you move? Yes. Why, yes, indeed, I can. That's a relief. I'm so glad. Let's so... This sucks. Yes. I'm so happy you're alright. I'm so glad. Thank you, miss. We owe you everything. You're welcome. I'm glad you two can dance again. Here, you can have this. I kept it since the day the others ripped our bodies apart. Acquired a special key. That is the key to the theater. I'm sure it will come in handy. Thank you so much. Now, will you give me this dance? Yes! Aww. I'm so happy I was able to help them. I can't understand what's written here. The handwriting is too messy. It's filled with children's books. <laughs> oh, I didn't know I was going to say it. Apparently, so that's it. Welcome to the most incredible of shows, the most amazing and impressive prose of a little girl whose days are counted with none of her wishes ever being granted. <laughs> Aren't I an impressive poet? Who are you? Don't trouble yourself with petty questions, miss, but do enjoy your statements. <laughs> Keep your memories close to your heart. in a very special garden there was a very special little girl she loved taking naps outside in the afternoon and doing nothing all day such a such an adorable little slob in fact she was such a privileged little girl she had her very own mountain of sweets but that's not all Ugly, her best of friends never left her side just like sisters from the same mother ha oh, I'm hilarious a noisy little brat and her stuffed doll what better companion than that? Together, they were a riot, known all over the kingdom as the Supreme Rulers, or just two silly little kids, I don't know. They told each other many secrets, even embarrassing ones. Tea time was a very important event where they discussed very serious things, which was the funniest pumpkin in the kingdom, for example. They also had many special cake parties. Ellie had, it, had indeed... Oh my gosh, this is going way too fast. She had a stuffed animal. One day, however, it started to rain, preventing her from leaving her house. What a shame. Inside, the house had a secret place, so secret no one could ever visit it. Nevertheless, the intelligent girl she was, she decided to go into it. It's not as if a little rain could keep them from having fun. Inside the very secret room was a very secret letter. What could be written in the most amazing secret? But what's this? The letter is filled with lies. Just who could have written all those lies? What were those lies doing inside the room? There was simply no way Feta could believe this. There was no way it was Feta's fault. It couldn't have been her fault. That's right. There was no way Flita could do involved in despicable affairs. Flita was nothing but a pure little girl. There was no way it could have been Flita's fault because there was a very clear culprit. It was all the mean girl's fault. The name of that very evil culprit is...
Oh my, things have gotten interesting. <laughs> What's going on? Let's talk to these pumpkins, though. That was quite a show, wasn't it? That's quite a show, wasn't it? I guess. I wanted to talk to you beforehand, but... These books on these shelves are glued onto the bookshelf. What? <laughs> Die, Grumperug. Oh, I cannot read that. There are so many coloring books. Afternoon tea. Rhymes for children. The Anatomy of... Macaulay by Robert. I've never seen this language before. stage talk to the other pumpkins okay I feel like when I walk out of here I'm gonna be murdered <sighs> mr. rabbit what happened isn't it obvious to you we took care of them you don't mean you've done this yourselves do you why yes we have wasn't our work done quite beautifully but why I thought all you wanted was to dance again oh sweetie you have yet much to learn, and apparently hatred is still one of those things. How could you do something like this? How could we? You are well aware of what they've done to us, and you not miss? This still doesn't justify what you've done. How doesn't it justify? Revenge, my dear, is a dish best served cold, do you understand? Now move along. We are very grateful for your good deeds towards us, after all. We owe you our most pure satisfaction. <laughs> She's on the table now. Ugh. Even the pumpkins aren't gonna talk. Pumpkin's a cat. Oh no, I'm allergic to cats. The queen is waiting you. No matter how faint they may be, they do serve a purpose and, and will, in one way or another, affect your own. I see. You can have this. I think it might clear you up a little bit. Oh, fortunately, I can't accompany you on your journey, but I'm sure this will be able to reassure you in times of distress. Thank you, mister. You're very kind. Aww. You know, I'm not actually not a very big fan of cats, but these cats are cute. Sir, 
about to start. How exciting! I'm so lucky, Miss. I wish I was an honored guest myself. An honored guest? Finally, now hurry on. The queen is awaiting you. Finally, now hurry on. Off with your head. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. Chocolate tiered cake. Impressive, I knew you would be able to reach me. What do you mean? Silence? I have but a couple of matters to address with you, my girl. First, I am hereby announcing your demise, for you will not be advancing further than this very room. Please wait. Silence. Secondly, my dear, since you will soon be disappearing for good, I shall pay you my respects. I have had enough with your mediocre attitude, my girl. I shall not tolerate it any further. As much as it is but a foolish gamble, I have made my own move. Now it's time for you to make yours. Okay. Please wait. I need you to explain what's going on. Guards? No, please wait. This, it's in your hands. My girl, it is your turn to claim what's yours. Oh god, oh god, I'm being chased, I'm guessing. Okay. Oh. Okay. that Shh, you shouldn't huh? disturb the dead the dead you haven't heard the three knocks have you I sure haven't I hope I don't Remember, remember, just how tender were the queen's sweet li little lies of a traitor in disguise. What does this mean? I didn't see anything. Don't ask me. It wasn't me. Mary, Mary, quite contrary. How does your garden grow with silver bells and... Cockle shells and pretty maids all in a row. It's locked. <laughs> it's peaceful and pure, just like Sleeping Beauty. It's have to be like scissors. I don't want to open that. A strong light overflows in between the iron bars, carrying a soft, cool breeze into the room. Huh? It's coming from the big chest. Do anything. Well, now I can go through here. <laughs> blue, blue. I'd go blue. I would definitely go with blue. Go with blue, blue. 
go with red. Red is the way to go. Go with red. Red. Can I go back through this door so I can save? No. Hmm. There's a note on the table. Hiding my darkened heart in a veil of innocence, I swore, weeping in the darkness, confiding with the moon. As the sun rises, I put my golden crown once more. I put on my golden crown once more, hoping to meet my beloved in the afternoon. So, I can be stolen or given away, and you will live, yet you cannot live without me. Okay, so they don't kill me, they just bring me back. If I go through the blue one, does it do that? Yeah. What letter is like a cow's tail? What letter is like a cow's tail? Sparkly key shaped like a heart decorated with a small leave it. A sparkly red key shaped like a bat decorated with small strap. Leave it. A blue key shaped like a moon decorated with a small strap. So we're going to try the golden one next. It fit. <laughs> Alright, so who was the funny bunny who locked me inside this chest? You're that girl. Who are you? Oh, I'm, I've never seen you around here before. How did you get here? I just... I see. Did you see who locked me up inside the chest by chance? Oh, no, I didn't. The chest was already locked when I got here. What a shame. <laughs> oh, well, that's alright. 
I'm a good detective, so I'll catch the culprit in no time. Oh, I see. So, what are you doing here, Miss Bats? Huh. Oh, did she know? Yes, alright then. Speaking of, have you seen her? I came here to get her, but someone locked me inside the chest. I, uh, <laughs> she must be in her throne. Let's go look for her. Alright. Oh, by the way, Miss, what's your name? Mine's Galeta. She's a princess. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't seem to remember my name right now. Really? That's weird. It sure is. Anyway, let's go look for her. I have a few royal matters to address with her. Alright. Press A to interact with characters in your party. That hurts. Shut up. Just hurry. Just a little bit more. I'm trying. Oh, that's creepy if you wear headphones. No, oh, I delete. Is she alright? Um, I'm glad. But she's ripped apart. Don't worry, I know how to sew. You do? Yes. Be careful. Here. I'll try my best. There, she's all ready. Oh, Igly, I'm so glad you're all right. Everything will be fine now. I'm here with you. What was that? You didn't see who it was? That's fine. All that matters is, is that you're safe now. <laughs> Thank you very much for saving Igly. Oh, no, it was nothing. Oh, no, I insist. <laughs> Igly, I have invited you to come to play with us at my dollhouse. Would you like to come? Really? Can I? Of course. Come on now, let's go. Stay back a little. I'm going to do a magic trick. A magic trick? Do you know how to do magic? <laughs> mm-hmm. Now watch. Ooh. A garden? Yes, this is my absolute favorite place to play. Oh, I see. <laughs> we need to go through to reach my dollhouse. Let's go. I will lead the way. If you haven't already, subscribe to my channel. If you like this video, hit that like button. Until next time, nice day.